good, yo. It's your boy Tab back here with another video. Before I dive any further, huge shout out to my guy Eric for making this gameplay possible. Pink Diamond Triple Threat Offline Reward, Terry Dishinger here. Uh, I know I pronounced his name wrong in the, in the previous video, but hopefully I can get it right for you guys. So, he is a Triple Threat Vault Reward. What does that mean? Uh, it really means every time you win a Triple Threat Offline game, you get the vault. If it opens, that means you have a chance to pull Pink Diamond Terry Dishinger. Now, it's not a very good chance. I want you guys to know that if you get lucky, you might pull him in... <laughs> under 50 games to be honest with you otherwise it's going to be very very such a long grind for you guys but definitely worth it for one of the best cards in the game probably before we dive any deeper if you aren't new to my channel and have not yet please smash that subscribe button as we are on the road to 50 000 subscribers looking at terry here 6 7 189 pounds 93 3 ball 95 driving dunk 86 ball handle 94 perimeter defense decent enough interior defense block and steal ratings decent enough rebound and 93 speed speed ball acceleration as well as that 94 lateral quickness which is absolutely absurd 100 driving dunk tendency is insane as well as pretty decent defensive tendencies you look across the board 85 pass interception tendency 80 on ball steal tendency 85 contest shot and block shot tendency as well 17 hall of famers for terry here catch and shoot corner specialist acrobat relentless finisher pick dodger intimidator off ball pest contact finisher fence footwork fast break finisher showtime slithery quick first step flexible range extender tyler shooter and volume shooter so the one thing I will say about Terry, it, compared to a lot of people, he has useful Hall of Fame badges. Like, a lot of people have, like, post-spin technician, drop stepper, dream shake, deep fades, deep hooks. Like, Terry doesn't have any of those fake badges that you don't need. 30 gold badges, ankle breaker, lob city finisher, pickpocket, chase the artist, clamps, hard crusher, pogo stick, tiles defender, trapper, consistent finisher, pro touch, bailout, downhill, handles for days, near threader, pass, fake, maestro, space, credit, tight handles, gold unpluckable, which is a very important badge because that can't be applied to players, gold dead eye, hot zone hunter, hot start, pump, fake, maestro, and slippery off ball as well. Badges, I would look to maybe give him dimer, rim protector, interceptor. Um, those are some of the most important ones. Clutch shooter, green machine, possibly. If you are next gen, maybe give him the, give him that blinders. I'm super, super glad he doesn't have steady shooter on current gen, no. Looking at Terry here, the first thing that bugs me is why is he number 53? Was he number 53 in, our, in, in, like, in real life? Does anybody know? Because that bugs me, man. I hate it. Why is he number 53? Like, I don't know, man. Maybe... <laughs> Okay, I can get past the fact that he's number 53. <laughs> I think I'll be able to get past that with, with as good as he should be, right? Because he should... Oh, my word, bro. Like, look at the way he moves. Let's see what... Okay, I can, I can get used to all this. Oh, my word. I can get used to all of this. Let me tell y'all. I promise you I can get used to everything he's working with. Now, I would say Dr. J, I never really used that much. And so, as far as the, as far as the Rudy Gay release is concerned, it's something that I feel like, for me personally... It's just going to take a little bit of time. Now, for most people, they'll have it down pat because it is a super smooth release. For me, it probably will just take me a couple days just to get this release down. Just because it is a Rudy release. It's pretty smooth with a mellow upper. You should be able to green consistently with it. The only thing I will say about it is it is on quick timing as well. So, it's a pretty quick, pretty smooth jump shot. I just personally, it's going to just personally take me a little bit of getting used to, I think. I think that's really it for me. But at the end of the day, he does have Hall of Fame quick first step has all the showtime dunks you could want in the world so really if you're if you're looking at terry right he's not just a shooter man he can go to the rim look at the dunk package he has showtime dunk galore and look at him bro six seven seven three wingspan and you can tell look at his player model his arms go down to his knees literally like absolutely crazy to think that we got this card in 2k it's just for me all going to be about can i green consistently in a game with him because right now I'm just slightly late on everything, which a lot of it is attributed to that release being on quick. Looking at my opponent here, he's got Baron Davis, Rudy Fernandez, Michael Jordan, Antoine Jameson, and Demarcus Cousins. So he's got a very good squad, but he does not have triple threat offline reward, Terry Dishinger. Yes, sir. I'm super, super excited to use Terry. It's like, even on defense, I'm excited to just see how he is in lanes and stuff, because that's the thing. I don't think he comes with interceptors, so that's something to know, but look at him beating Rudy up on the defensive end. Like, it's just all off ball right now, and he is beating him up. Good defense. Oh, yeah, we're sitting on that. Oh, uh, up to Terry. Ah, come here. Bro, let's get my free lane set. Come here, come here, come here, come here. Chill, Baron. Oh, don't get hit by the screen. You just got killed Perfect. by a screen. And that's not a good recipe, especially against Car Terry, to get hit by a screen right there. Good start to the game. I want to know. Oh, he has sharp take. I kind of like that. 
Oh, that should be me. Yup, good defense. You know who my point guard is. Chill, get him the rock. Oh, yeah. Pro 8 me. That's not Pro 8, Terry. That's not Pro 8, Terry. Hey, 360 Showtime Slam. Oh, yeah, look at him. You just got blown by. That's. I mean, that's just Rudy Fernandez having Hall of Fame quick first step, though. Oh, that's me. I, I, and that's the thing. Like, I feel like I'm eventually going to get his release down. Come on, Cam. Good defense. Uh-oh. Terry time. Ah, ah, ah. Terry time. Ter oh, my word. He got it lightly. That's fine. Back to Terry. Don't jump. There it is. Come on, green. I got to green with his release. That's really all there is to it. Slightly early. At least I'm seeing, you know, some different things on the release. I feel like eventually I'll be able to get it time. But that's the only thing right now is I'm just not greening consistently with him. It is, it's not Terry's fault. It's just my fault. Can you stop leaving my guys open, please? Like, look at what he's doing with DeMarcus Cousins. He's just sitting paint because he knows what Terry Dishinger is about, right? He's got to sit paint so I don't get showtime. And that's just the risk you got to take. I'm fine. Yep, we're fine. Thank we're fine. We're sitting again. on that. Uh-huh. Come on, Terry. Over the way again. Uh oh back to Terry. You should have not came off Terry. I'm telling you, now he's got it in him. He's got takeover. And we're moving and grooving. Uh oh Wade's there. Where's Terry? Where's my man's Terry? Chill. Back to him. Bro, chill, 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 chill. chill. That's so tough. That's such a tough shot. Like, how are you going to defend that? And the thing is, right now, I don't have to really worry about much because he does have unpluckable. If he didn't have unpluckable, I'd be worried about... I got a full... If he didn't have unpluckable, I would maybe be a little bit more worried. But because of unpluckable, he can be my primary ball handler. And I don't really got to worry about anything, right? You guys are seeing him just go absolutely berserk because he is really like that. Oh, yeah, getting bumpy for me on the defensive end. Oh, ah, ah. What in the... I didn't even mean to take a drifter, but he can do that. Look at Terry, man. Yeah. That's fine. That's a good shot. No momentum. No algo. Uh-oh. Up to Terry. Ah, ah. Don't jump. He jumped. I got to green it. That's my fault, Terry. It's just all about how much I can green with the card. Because if I start greening with him, trust me, it is going to be rough for my opponent. Chill. Where's Terry? Walk back. Ah. The thing is, it's like he's just drawing so much attention on the defensive end. And I'm going to be unselfish. If if my opponent or if, you know, he's giving too much attention to, you know, one specific person, I'm going to spread the wealth. There he's sitting on Terry. It is what it is. A very impressive first quarter from Dishinger. Now, we will get Terry a break here in just a little bit. But I got I to gotta see something out. Oh my goodness, who is that? David Robinson put him in the rim. Oh yeah, oh yeah, where's Terry? Fine, Terry. Oh, reach out of position. Come here. It's like his playmaking... Oh my, Terrence Ross came over, but it's like his playmaking badges are ridiculous as well. I need to get him a break. He is really exhausted, but playmaking badges are ridiculous. Shooting badges are ridiculous. What can this card not do? Step man at six at, with six seven with his seven three wings man. You know what we get into. Up to him. Let's see some showtime. Hey, I don't know. I don't know about that dunk right there. I thought that could get blocked, but he is doing his thing right now. A right, couple more possessions and then we are going to get you a break. Terry, it's fine. Come back. Like, what do you? How are you supposed to guard that right there? It's really almost nearly impossible to guard. Uh oh. Got my feet set. It's just so tough. His release is so quick that sometimes I feel like it's tough to green. I'm going to get Terry takeover one more time before we get him this rest. And when I get him a rest, it'll probably be a five-minute rest. But I do want to get him takeover. Just look at the score for a second. Like, he might get a long rest here. That's too deep. Oh, my word. And when I say Hall of Fame flexible is a thing, too, trust me. It's a thing. I don't know how that shot went in. Like, I literally have no idea how that shot went in. It was an, it, it, it was from way too deep. I should have never even shot it. Plus, I didn't green it. So, it's like those two things combined, should it should have had no chance to go in. Chill. If I was trying to throw the slip, that would be way too easy. 
can you just give me a little bit of space? Like, he's forcing me sideline, and I don't like it, man. Let me go middle. There's no way you send a double team. There's no way you're double teaming him on the catch. There is no way I'm seeing this right now. All right, since you want to play this type of defense, I need to see something. I need to see something. Let's not call a screen so you can't double team me, and that way I can get my open look when I need it. Nah, this card is tough. The more I get used to his release, the greener it is, and oh my, whoo, baby. He is tough. Uh-oh. Get, get it to the man with a plan. Nah. He just killed Monte. The thing is, I felt like I dribbled all possession, yet I'm still fresh. Like, I'm still fresh, can do what I want to do. You draw two defenders. It's, I mean... He is, he is just doing everything. Looking at the halftime box score, guys, you can't make this up. 36 points, 6 assists, 4 steals, 13 of 18 from the field, and 10 of 14 from deep. Finally, in the third quarter, we got a quiz. So that's really all that happened in that unlimited game. I got him a break in the third quarter. was really not doing anything. Just trying to get my man's arrest, my man's Terry arrest. But we did get a quiz. So we saw what he was like in my team unlimited. Now we're going to see what he's like in a triple threat online game. Here we're up against Banana Man 40005. So he's got Isaiah Thomas, who isn't going to be guarding Terry, which is good. Okay, so I think it's going to be Anton Jameson um, on Terry. It is the matchup I think is going to be. So he's a decent enough defender. So we'll see. We'll see how he does defend him. I mean, I mean, whoa. I mean, how are you supposed to defend him? That's my question. How are you supposed to defend Terry? Can y'all please grab a board? Thank you. Uh-oh. Showtime me, Terry. Hey, between the legs on top of Isaiah Thomas. Yeah, let's go, Terry. Give me the ball. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I forgot about... Oh, my. I for, I even forgot that he had that. I haven't even been using the Curry escape. Oh, my. You add that to his repertoire. Oh, bro. Ooh, baby, Terry is cooking right now. He's shooting full quarters because he knows what it is. He knows who's he knows who's the king of my team now, and it's not me. Let me tell you, it's not me. It's this man's Terry. Oh yeah, just keep shooting full quarters because you're you know what it is. You're down bad. Terry's got everybody down. That's all right. I'll make the extra pass. I'm gonna be unselfish. Over to D Wade for three. Oh yeah. Good box out. I like to see that. Hold up. Ah, nah, you're a, you're literally a, you're incredible. I found your release timing, and now it's over with. I didn't really have it in my team unlimited, but I don't know if I've wanted a shot here in this triple threat game. The only thing is worrying me. Obviously, Antoine Anton's a better rebounder, and so that's kind of a mismatch. But when you play him at the shooting guard position, I don't think you're gonna have to worry too much about that. Ah, Curry slide into a. I laid it. That's me. That's my first nine green. I think I jinxed myself. Do what you got to do, IT. Give me a bucket. Yeah, I just wanted him to get a bucket. I, I I want him to have a good day, too. So, oh, yeah, Terry. Ah, show me that. Oh, my. Pro it. Ah, ah, hit me. Oh, I shot another white. I wanted to shoot that just to see if I could get an open out of it. I got an open, but I just missed it. Ah, come here, Terry. His release is tough. That with Pro 2. I mean, I wasn't even thinking about the Curry slide, but now that I know he has it, oh my word. Look at it, Terry, and the only really three I missed was the one that I shredded with takeover, I'm pretty sure. 20 points, two rebounds, one assist, seven of eight from the field, and six of seven from deep. Guys, I knew Terry Dishinger was going to be good. I knew it. I could tell from his stats, badges, his six, he would be good. I didn't think he would be this good, though. I mean, I really didn't. The only thing that bugs me is his jersey number. And if that's the biggest thing that is a is a, is a negative to me, then he's obviously super, super good. He has Pro 2. Even without Pro 2, he would still be a top card in the game. You add that into his moves with unpluckable handles for days, his smooth, quick release, I'm telling you, you're going to want to grind for Terry Dishinger. That's all I'm going to say. Now, depending on what we get on Friday, it could change the game completely if we get like a super soup Opal T-Mac or something like that. Obviously, that's going to change the game completely. But right now, as far as it is concerned, Terry Dishinger is by far and away the best guard we do have in NBA 2K21. 
I still think Anthony Davis overall is the best overall player we have, but as at the guard position, there's nobody better than Terry. He is a way better version of Rudy Fernandez, and I think that's the most accurate comparison I can give to you guys. But I hope you guys did enjoy the video. Again, I do recommend you guys playing Triple Threat offline for the card. Drop a like on the video. Subscribe if you are new. And as always, man, I love you guys, and have a blessed day.